Welcome to video 17A in the Bear Souls series with Grizzly and Orlando. Okay, now it's, it's been a couple days since I've been able to play because I recorded the, the two videos for Sen's Fortress, one right after the other, and it took me, I don't know, two or three days to edit everything, get them online. So consequently, I kind of made a little vow to myself that I don't want to make videos that long again. <laughs> it just takes too long. So I'm going back to an earlier practice too, that when I die, I'm going to cut the film there and then I'll splice it to just before I pick up my soles again. So you don't have to watch me running all the way back, fighting all the way back to, to pick up my souls. Right now I'm just doing a quick visual inspection at the base of the stairs, see if anything has changed. I don't notice anything, so I'm ready for the first gargoyle. Confidence is high. We have the Eagle Shield plus 10, Die Handler plus 10. So, and I wasn't really interested in getting his tail either. Usually I really make a concerted effort to get the tail for the, the gargoyle, halberd. But, I'm at too high of a level to take advantage of it now. What, that was uh, strength of 16, dexterity of 14. Which I think I I meet both of those requirements, but Gargoyle at Hellbred isn't going to be as strong as the Zai Handler. Although, come to think about it, it wouldn't make farming the skeletons and in the uh, in needles area a lot easier if I had it. So I like that swing motion, but too late now. <laughs> okay. I don't know if you can tell, but I have the auto correction for the camera shut off. That way I don't have to worry about uh the camera angle adjusting my uh, my path and having me fall to my death. I think I did that in the first video. Okay, these guys are a little bit harder to kill than I was hoping. <laughs> Okay, low level guys, low level technique, I would be using poison arrows, take these guys out. If I was on new game plus and I had the strength and dexterity to do it, I'd be using the, the dragon bow arrow, just knock them off. <laughs> I don't like fighting on the rafters. However, that being said, when I've been invaded while I'm, while I'm up here, um, my win-loss ratio is in my favor. But I do hate it. <laughs> That's why I changed to the poise ring, so that it wouldn't be pushing me backwards. One down. What is it, like three to go? <laughs> Two to go? Okay, everything still looks the same. Okay.
Now there's two schools of thought on this. You know, mine up on them. So he pushes you straight backwards. Ouch. And he followed me down. He's so nice. Okay, here's the cut. My souls are up ahead. Yeah, they're they're way in the distance there. I, I wonder why. <laughs> wonder why I didn't just uh, cut to it just before I uh, picked them up. But the other school of thought is is to back off and let them run on our diagonal to you, where they just fall off. <laughs> which I kind of wish I would have done on that previous one. And here, I try to quit real quick and it didn't work. Ah, now you know. Okay, cut again. <laughs> Voila, right back up here. Okay, this time I'm going to try magic, maybe. I can't remember. Okay, I'm going to grab my souls before I die. <laughs> Gold shield. Hey, it's been a long time. I don't, I don't know if I've ever seen them bring out a gold shield. Of course, I usually use poison arrows to take them out. So you guys have to tell me, is that new? Was that perhaps patched somewhere where they don't have a gold shield? Um, that kind of looked like a. That looked like the the gold version of the target shield, didn't it? Wow. Okay. Hey, look at that. Pushed him right off. Okay. I don't think I die again in this whole video, so. Oh well. There was that running on a diagonal trick. They just run right off. Okay, guys. Um, most of you probably know by now. It took me a long, long time to figure out how to reach that chest that's on the other. that's across the room from me now. But there's a very easy way to get it. Easy when you know how. Yep. There'll be a guy here right around the corner. Oh, he's got the gold shield too, so... Okay, there we are. We're back. And I gotta tell you, the first time I picked up this divine blessing here, I couldn't figure out how to get back, so I home boned it. But, duh, going back is so easy. Okay, ready to go through the fog gate and deal with the second gargoyle. Do, 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 do. Got a little trick for this guy too. Ah, uh, this may be obvious. If you turn that handle counterclockwise, you go down. Aqua should go up. Easy way to remember. Okay, as soon as you get the platform down, I would sit, I advise that you go over here and get on solid ground. Because if you die, your souls are going to be up there on the ledge to the left. Because that was the last piece of solid ground you were on. So if you die here... You know, you're just coming in from the bonfire and you can pick up your souls before you fight this guy again.
kind of hoping he would just come for me, but he's hanging back. And look at that. It's like a delayed stun. You hit him and it's like a split second later he gets a stun. So maybe they patch that as well. I don't remember that little hesitation. Okay, he's got a gargoyle shield. And he didn't drop anything. But I'm not wearing the discovery ring either. Okay. Now I'm trying to decide. Do I want to send the, the wheel, the platform down and rest at the bonfire? And have to walk back up the stairs again or just go in straight here to the painted world and I decided the odds are fairly low that I will, will not die before I reach the painting at the back of the room so I decide not to rest at the, the bonfire guy's got a shield too. Maybe maybe they've had shields all along. And I only notice it now because I'm trying to notice differences. But it seems like I always remember them dual welding. I don't I don't remember them using a shield. Yep, they're good dodgers. Well of magic anyway. Boy, if I was farming uh, throwing knives, I'd be real happy. This hidden body seems to be working well on these guys. I say that just before hidden body wears off. spell this is great magic weapon okay yeah I should try that too see uh, I say that you guys don't bring me to task but I've got like three or four videos recorded since I'm commenting on this one so it'll probably be Yes, I'm currently back at An Orlando now, so I suppose I could try it in here. So that's gonna be An Orlando dash B. Okay. And we're coming up on the end of this video, but the painted world video is uh is really worth watching too because there's uh, there's new content <laughs> it's been a long time since I watched this video too I don't remember this uh, well I don't want to spoil it for you there we go <laughs> this black and purple I don't remember that purple uh, tint in there that was pretty cool. Okay, painted world. Video uh, 18A is next in the series. Uh, let's see. I think I think I'm going to reverse hollow. I'm gonna kindle this bonfire because I'm gonna stay here. I think I stay here through three videos. So. 
Yep. Yeah, I gotta eat another humanity. Which I don't mind so much because there's two within this level to pick up. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. I'll talk to you later. Bye.